Let's take a quick look at parallel processing. 1010 data is designed as a massively parallel multiprocessor system. Computations are divided into components and distributed to a cluster of computation servers. In non-parallel systems, a single machine computes a data set query. If it takes an hour to compute all the data, the query takes an hour. Even with more machines, you can't run the query any faster. However, queries can often be broken into subcomponents. If you want to add 100 million numbers, the non-parallel approach simply adds 100 million times. Total computation time is the time it takes to perform 100 million additions. Let's do better. Now we have 10 machines. We split the data so each machine has 10 million numbers. We can now have each machine sum 10 million numbers. We then add up the 10 partial sums to get our answer. With this approach, computation time is the time required for 10 million additions, plus one more at the end. This is 10 times faster than a non-parallel system. Here we see the parallel computation steps for our 100 million numbers. The data is divided into subcomponents, with each subcomponent computed separately, simultaneously, and in parallel in steps 1 through 10. Step 11 adds up the partial sums for the answer. Step 11 takes almost no time since it's just the sum of 10 numbers. Here, we get a 10x speedup. Subcomponents need to be about the same size. If one subcomponent is much larger than the others, it becomes the bottleneck. Identifying and exploiting opportunities for parallel processing leads to the best 1010 data performance.